How hard is it to reopen German nuclear plants? Let's take a look. According to the 2024 Radiant Energy Report, about 14 reactors can be reopened with just minor to moderate updating. The report classifies German reactors into four restart categories based on their current condition. Restart class one is minimal decommissioning, requiring mainly maintenance and staff rehiring. Restart class two is where some dismantling has occurred, but major components are still intact. Restart class three is extensive dismantling, but the containment building is still usable, and restart class 4 means the containment building has been damaged or demolished. This graph focuses on classes 1 through 3, showing exactly what infrastructure was present at each plant and which might need to be updated. As you can see here, class 1 has almost everything intact, while class 2 reactors need more significant repairs in areas like the turbine and generator or coolant systems. Bringing a restart class 1 reactor back online could cost up to a billion euros at the max, while restarting class 2 reactors could require investments of up to 3 billion euros. All of these amounts are a fraction of what it would cost to build a new reactor elsewhere, especially especially considering that these plants still have several decades of their useful life remaining. Now, barriers to these restarts include fuel supply, Germany's declining nuclear supply chain, and rehiring and retraining a skilled workforce, all of which have prescribed solutions in the report. The biggest barrier is convincing politicians, per usual. <laughs> Germany would have to amend its Atomic Energy Act, and getting the political consensus to do that would be a big lift. Some parties and leaders have made anti-nuclear positions central to their platform, and reversing their position just might not be worth the risk. The decommissioning industry is also huge in Germany, with hundreds of jobs and billions of dollars at stake. Can Germany reverse their bad decisions to regain a bit of energy independence, lower carbon emissions, and make efficient use of resources? Experts say yes. Will they? We sure hope so.